In this DeBacco University student series video, we're going to be looking at how PAR readings change with the light type and the distance those plants are away from those lights. We're going to be comparing an LED light with a fluorescent light in this video. Before I get into the video, I just want to show you the two different types of lights that are going to be uh, looked at in this video. The LED light is a Fluent Spider X Plus 660 watt, and the fluorescent light is an AgriBright Designer T5 324 watt fluorescent light. Just so you have some background, hope you enjoy the video. So right now we're taking a PAR reading with all of our lights on to measure how different the readings are at different distances. So right now at the absolute top, we're at a good 650. Now at six inches down, we lower down to just 370. At another six inches down, we're measuring 216. Go down another six inches, we're at just 120. And finally, another six inches, we've made it down to 64, double digits. So that's why it's very important to know how far away you're going to want your plants to be from your light source. So now we're comparing our 600 watt LED lights to our fluorescent lights that we were just showcasing. So you can see they're pretty much at the same height level. So this is just to compare how drastically different the PAR rating is at the same level just from a different light. So right up at the top here, we're reading at 2,000. If we go six inches down, we lower down to a 780. 12 inches down, we're reading 630. 18 inches down, we're reading 558. And 24 inches down, we're reading four, I mean 390. So you can see this is very different and much more intense than the fluorescent lights that we're currently using on our clones. 